Hey everybody, how y'all doing? We got something I've been testing out before I decided to film it. And uh, this is the old parts Camaro here. Kind of making her look too good to go to the junkyard, aren't we? Oh yeah, I got one of these uh, Eastwood uh, Contour SCTs. And uh, got the abrasive disc on it. And I did all that, that, that part of the car in just a few minutes, literally. I know it's going to depend on the condition of your paint, your car, how many times it's been painted. But so far, this thing's working pretty good, and I like how it goes over this and doesn't leave a bad edge. So, let's show you. As you guys noticed, when I was up over here, it kind of grabbed. I've learned one thing real quick. Don't have anything sticking up above what you're working. And look at how nice it worked that. Try and do that with a DA or whatever. Let me grab the camera and show you guys close them. Stay up there. Oh, happy. So yeah, I mean, I right got here, found a dent. I mean, it just makes it so good to do. And uh, here's the trunk lid. That's what the trunk lid looked like. 
That's what it looks like now. So I can get it where it ain't got the glare. So that old machine. I'd be lying if I say it wasn't a workout, but it kind of feels good. We're gonna do the press that trunk lid in real time. Get the cord past you guys. Sorry. Okay. Let's see what you guys are seeing. I'd point you the other way, but I'm afraid the sun would glare it out. But you see what this side of the trunk look like? Here. Let it get up the spade. There you go. Like I said, that was real time there, guys. And I see the camera got dusty. I'm doing this outside, yes, if you see. Uh, but yeah, there you guys go. Uh, nice brush metal. Hit that with the sandpaper that they got. Those surfaces would be great for body work and like right here. Found where it's rusted through here, dent there, dent there. So, yes, I really like that sander so far. 
But it didn't take long to take that off on the rough. And I even tried it here on the hood to see how it got around. It did this edge pretty good. This edge leaves a little work. And this hood is rusted out from the inside out. I got holes popping through. But yeah, a good test candidate to see how thing is going to work. I'm really happy with it. And like I said, the condition of your paint's going to determine what you do. And it's not any hotter. I can't touch it because of the sun. That's not because of what I've done, but yeah, you can see the old lead line. That's just with the rough stuff. This is ready. You come back when you hit it with that sandpaper. And boy, that'd be ready for a coat of primer already. What I like too is uh, up here on the hood. Where was it? Oh, it lets you know that you got to. I can't see it's all glare. Hopefully I showed you. But anyway, yeah. Last time this thing's going to look good before it goes to the crusher. And yeah, she's gone, guys. It is all far gone. There's better candidates than this one. Not about saving the tr trunk lid, but like I said, it's rusting from the inside out. Looks good out here. Make somebody a nice stock car hood, but anyway, I guess I gotta get picked up and get out of here. So I'm real happy with that. And there again is the pad that's on that. And it's wearing pretty good. I can tell now it will be worth my time to order more. Because uh, we got a project car there and one around the corner that you see the tail light on. So. All right, everybody, y'all take care.